life, eh, DK? You said it, Diddy. DK, I was just thinking. The Temple of Inka Dinkadoo has been here forever, hasn't it? Longer than forever. So, who built it? I mean, if it's been here longer than forever, whoever built it must have been on Congo Bongo before forever. Whoa, now that's something to think about. Let's ask the one who knows. For me to know, you not to find out. Huh, figures, it's a secret. Ah, uh, come on, lay it on us, old Inka Dinka Idol. After all, having a secret's no fun unless you share it with somebody. Donkey Kong, share everyone. <laughs> no kidding! Tell DK and it'll be all over Congo Bongo before you can say spill the beans. What do you mean? I can keep a secret. Yeah, right. Like the time I told you about my rash? Or when Cranky told you about his rash? Or when Candy told you about all her right, rash? All right, all right, I get the picture. Yeesh. Secrecy, that is the key to diabolical success. Which is why Project X must be kept ultra top secret. Affirmative, almighty leader of lizards. Ultra tip top secret. Why Project X is so hush hush. Even I don't have the fuckiest idea what it is. And I'm the head of security. I had each critter build one part at home in his spare time. Now, I shall personally assemble Project X in complete darkness, while keeping my eyes closed at all times, so as not to breach security. Uh -oh. Ah! Oh! And remember, no peeking! Soon I will unleash my most diabolical device yet. The crystal coconut is as good as mine. <laughs> Who built the ancient and mysterious temple of Inca Dinkadu? Now why do you knuckleheads suppose it's called mysterious? Huh? Um We don't no? Exactly. It's a mystery. No one knows who built it. The end. Uh, what are you boys doing here? Aren't you supposed to be out fine swinging or something? We have to see Cranky about, uh, um... I mean, banana cake recipe. Yeah. <laughs> Bye. Hey, it's the Donkey and Diddy dudes. Funky. See ya. Uh, you don't know who built the Temple of Inca Dinka Do, do ya? <laughs> of course I Inca Dinka Do. Why don't you lay it on us, Funky? Hang on to your thongs, dudes, cause the answer is out of this world. That far out temple could only have been built by some very far out interplanetary visitor dudes. Huh? You mean like little green apes in flying saucers? All right, you got it, DK. Give me an anti-gravity five. Uh-huh. Whoops. Has to fill you in about our cosmic cousins later, dudes. I gotta see the ancient type dude about a... Whoa! Banana cake recipe! They're out there. Somewhere, waiting for that big intergalactic wave to bring them back to the beach. <laughs> yeah, right. What for? To bring universal peace and harmony. Or to turn everybody into zombie slaves using their interplanetary mind control vibes. Who can tell? Chilling out in space. There's some alien looking dudes scoping out this place. With big melon heads and beady green eyes, they have slimy sucking tentacles that paralyze. Out of this world comes interplanetary visitor dudes. Turn you into zombies. They'll make you their slaves, put you on display, and cage you up in a zoo. 
and hop up and down on one foot. <sighs> well, time to turn in. The early dude catches the wave. <laughs> top secret maximum security procedures. Yes, sir. We are now code red. You couldn't pry these bloodshot baby blues open with a... Ah! No, no problem. Minimal damage. Has remained sealed. Security's not been breached. Sir? Good. Then make yourself useful and fetch me a shrimp and mudweed sandwich. Roger, sir. I'll show rendezvous at 1200 hours with a little midnight snack. Excellent. Project X is back from its very first test flight, right on schedule. Uh, I'm back. Of course you're back. The boomerang apparel always comes back. That's the beauty of my clever design. Yeah. As soon as the test phase of Project X is completed, your assignment will be to swoop stealthily in, snatch the crystal coconut, and return before those dull witted apes know what's happened. <laughs> Claire, Diddy. Those interplanetary visitor dudes only come out at night. We hope. Oh, come on. We gotta warn the others. Warn the others? Oh. About what? We're under attack. It's an invasion. They're here. The little green apes from outer space. Ah! We saw them last night. They tried to turn us into zombies with their alien mind vibes. That's nice. We'd love to hear more, but we're kind of in a hurry. Don't you want us to protect you? No. I mean, it's nice of you to offer, but, uh, we're on our way I... to... Get our hair done. You know, uh, girl stuff. Oh, look! Dolphins! Where? I don't see any. Hey, where'd they go? Cranky! Cranky! We gotta do something! Interplanetary visitor dudes! They've come back! It's an invasion! They're, They're gonna, gonna zombify us! us. I'll smackify the both of you if you don't knock off this science fictional nonsense. We saw him last night zooming across the sky in a spaceship. Hmm. Saw us shooting stars, more likely. We better stick close, Cranky, for your protection. No! Last thing I need is you two tagging along to the, uh, the to my uh, hair appointment. Kill a whale! Where? <laughs> oh, great! Aliens are taking over Congo Bongo, and all anybody's doing about it is getting their hair done! Come on, little buddy. Funky will believe us for sure. Hey, dudettes. About time you got here. Sorry, Funky. It seems 
seems every time we turn around, we bump into DK and Diddy. But don't worry, we gave them the slip. So did I. <sighs> I think I slipped the disc doing it. Going up. You see that, DK? Ooh, this is weird. Yeah. I didn't know Funky was opening a hair salon. Remember, secrecy is the key to success if we're going to pull this off. You said it, cranky dude. We want this to be like a total surprise. So, let's get on with our plan. A plan? Leapin' lemurs? Know what I think? Interplanetary visitor dudes have taken over their brains and turned them all into zombie apes. Who are at this very minute wanting to take over Congo Bongo? Find out what they're up to, DK. I'll get us a supply of green bananas. All right, little buddy. It's DK. He's been spying on us. Bummer. He probably heard everything. You'd better not tell Diddy, DK. Ha! Do your zombie worst. No interplanetary visitor dude mind vibes can control my brain. No kidding. They'd never be able to find it. Wise up, you numbskull. There's no such thing as interplanetary visitor dudes. Ha! I bet that's what all the mind-controlled zombie apes say. Chill, DK dude. I got that zombie stuff from a movie I saw on the lit, 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 lit show. You see, there is no such thing as interplanetary visitor dudes. Not ones that turn people into zombies, anyway. The ones I've met have always been real mellow. In an alternate life form kind of way. But me and Diddy overheard you planning to take over Congo Bongo. Didn't we? We've been trying to plan a surprise party for Diddy's birthday. A surprise party for my little buddy? All right. But why wasn't I invited to help with the plans? Because it's supposed to be a surprise. <laughs> I can't so keep a secret. Yeah, yeah right. right. Well, this time, I double DK promise I won't spill the beans. <laughs> oh, this'll keep away those pesky interplanetary mind vibes. Hey, Diddy! Yeah! Oh, DK, you shouldn't sneak up on a guy when he's trying to stop an alien invasion. Here, have a green banana. Aw, oh, forget all that stuff, little buddy. There aren't any interplanetary dudes or zombie apes planning to take over Congo Bongo. Oh, yeah? So what was everybody doing at Funky's place? Oh, they were planning a... Oh. Uh, they were, uh, well, they're just trying to, uh, I mean, uh, uh, nothing you need to worry about. <laughs> You're one of them! <laughs> Those interplanetary brain nappers have turned you into a space zombie to do their evil bidding! Did he wait? DK, if you're still in there, don't worry. I'll think of a way to save you somehow. Uh, it's worse than I thought. My best pal is an alien zombie. And now he's out to get me because he knows I know he knows I know he's a zombie. Don't recall it being such a long march to the mess hall. Back off, you scaly-tailed zombie swamp rat! Huh? Who goes there? A furball? What are you doing in King Carew's kitchen? What's this jungle doing in King Carew's kitchen? Wait a minute. Clump can't be a zombie controlled by interplanetary visitor dude brain vibes. He doesn't have a brain. Where does he keep the slime spray? Clump, I'm desperate! You gotta help me! Me? Help a furball? Listen up, you empty skulled reptile. We gotta act fast before it's too late. Congo Bongo, maybe the whole world, is being invaded by interplanetary visitors and turning everyone into zombies. <laughs> <laughs> Little green lizards from Mars? <laughs> Stop! Stop it, you're killing me! <laughs> <laughs> I saw it with my own highly trained eyes. 
spinning through the sky. They're gonna turn the whole island into some sort of resort where they'll be waited on hand and foot by their army of mind-controlled zombies. Who will be us? Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, what will we do? The aliens are planning their deadly invasion. They're armed with ray guns and mind-melting powers. Who knows what evil we can expect? Prepare yourself for a horrific encounter. In every monkey's life comes a time when you should stand up and fight. If you want some self-respect, then get ready and watch the skies. There's only one chance to stop these invaders. You could turn them back with the coconut's power. Get the crystal and you go down in history. This could be Diddy's finest hour. You could be the hero. There's a brilliant light that shines from your eyes. Are you sick of being a zero? Just look up and watch the skies. It's up to you to watch the skies! No green slime from another planet's gonna turn my pals into zombies! I'll get you that crystal coconut carool, and then we'll kick some interplanetary butt! If they have butts, that is. They might have two! Or three. Clump, this little fur pop. Uh brave volunteer is going to need your help. Me? Ah, oh, but, um, I still have to go make that sandwich, and, uh... Yes, sir. Happy to volunteer, sir. Diddy Kong, your name will go down in Congo Bongo history. Yeah! It will, won't it? <laughs> <laughs> Crusher! Your mission to steal the crystal coconut has been scrubbed. I've just arranged to have it hand delivered to me. Personally, by a gullible simian simpleton. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Your new assignment is to fly the boomerang apparel over Congo Bongo, spreading more fear and panic in your way. <laughs> Good going, DK. Now what are we supposed to do? The whole gang is inside waiting. We've got the decorations up and everything. Don't worry, Candy. I'll get them. Just remember. Yeah, yeah, I know. Don't spoil the surprise. Surprise! It's just me. Aww. Bummer. Mm -hmm. We're gonna teach those interplanetary brain stealers a little lesson in Congo Bongi and manners. Diddy! Yeah! Oh, finally, I found you. What are you doing with the crystal coconut, little buddy? I'm gonna get my buddy's brain back, that's what! <laughs> Zombie! Ha! Ah, just what I'd expect a zombie to say! Step on it! No? <laughs> That's it! My hairy hero! <laughs> Bring the coconut home to Papa Carool! <laughs> What's this? Oh, that interfering ape will ruin everything! Crusher! Knock Donkey Kong off their trail! Yes, <laughs> Faster! He's gaining on us! Affirmative! Pedals to the metal! <laughs> you know, next time maybe I should drive! Affirmative! <laughs> well, at least I got the crystal coconut back! Yay! Whoa! There really are interplanetary visitor too! I got it! I got it!
a planetary visitor to... Huh? I should have known. All right, zombie! Drop that coconut! Diddy, I didn't want to tell you this, but... You are no match for us, puny Earth Whoa, ape. Oh, that does it! Come back here, you mindless, lily-livered alien zombie! Good thing my mama taught me to always wear my helmet. Hey, you slimy interplanetary invader types look awful familiar. I don't feel so good. <laughs> Not on my clean uniform, idiots! The crystal coconut was in my grasp! <laughs> I'll send them both to the moon for this! Nanya, can't catch me! I'm gonna tear those aliens limb from limb! Or tentacle from tentacle! Surprise! Yeah! Diddy! Diddy! Hmm, he must have had one too many green bananas. Happy Inca Dinka birthday! <laughs> <laughs>